What if Earth isn't the best planet for life in the universe? Imagine discovering a world more habitable than our own, full of water, lush landscapes, and perfect temperatures. Join us as we explore these incredible possibilities. Welcome back, explorers. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of exoplanets, specifically those that might be even more habitable than Earth. Scientists, including renowned physicist Michio Kaku, believe these superhabitable planets could be the future homes for humanity. Let's delve into what makes these worlds so special and why they're capturing the imagination of scientists worldwide. The search for planets like Earth has always been the holy grail of astronomy. However, recent findings suggest we might be setting our sights too low. Michio Kaku has highlighted the discovery of planets that could be even more favorable for life than our own. These are known as habitable exoplanets, and they're scattered throughout our galaxy. One such potential candidate is Proxima Centauri b, an exoplanet in the habitable zone of Proxima Centauri, just 4.2 light-years away. However, challenges like tidal locking and intense radiation make it less than ideal. But what if there are planets out there that not only support life but do so better than Earth? Scientists like René Heller and John Armstrong argue that the ideal conditions for life might include factors beyond simply being in a star's habitable zone. For example, planets orbiting orange dwarf stars, which are smaller and cooler than our Sun, might provide stable conditions for billions of years, much longer than the lifespan of our solar system. Moreover, a planet's size and mass play crucial roles. A world slightly larger than Earth could have a more stable climate and thicker atmosphere, enhancing its ability to support a diverse range of life forms. And let's not forget about water, a key ingredient for life. Planets with smaller water bodies, like lakes and shallow seas, might be more conducive to biodiversity than those dominated by vast oceans. Astrobiologists are pushing the boundaries of our understanding of planetary habitability, broadening the criteria by which we search for life-supporting worlds. Traditionally, the focus has been on finding exoplanets within a star's habitable zone, an area where conditions might allow liquid water to exist. However, new insights suggest that our search parameters could be too narrow, and we might be overlooking planets that are not only capable of supporting life but could potentially do so even better than Earth. This has led to the concept of superhabitable planets, worlds that might offer even more favorable conditions for life to thrive. One key aspect of this expanded search is the consideration of planets that are slightly warmer and wetter than Earth. The reasoning behind this lies in the relationship between climate and biodiversity. On Earth, some of the most biologically diverse ecosystems are found in warmer and wetter climates, such as tropical rainforests. These regions are home to a staggering variety of species, suggesting that similar conditions on other planets could foster rich ecosystems. Astrobiologists hypothesize that a planet with slightly higher average temperatures than Earth might support a broader range of life forms. Warmer temperatures can increase metabolic rates in organisms, potentially leading to faster growth and reproduction. However, there is a fine balance to be struck. Too much heat can lead to environmental extremes that are detrimental to life, such as desertification or extreme weather patterns. Therefore, the ideal superhabitable planet would be warmer than Earth but still within a range that supports stable, life-friendly conditions. Water is a critical factor in the search for habitable planets. On Earth, water is essential for all known life forms, serving as a solvent in biochemical reactions and a medium for nutrient transport. The presence of water also helps regulate a planet's climate, maintaining temperatures within a range that can support liquid water and, by extension, life. Superhabitable planets might not only have abundant water but also possess a more favorable distribution of it. Instead of vast oceans, which can limit biodiversity by creating uniform environments. These planets might have more fragmented land masses, resulting in a greater number of coastal areas. Coastal regions are typically rich in nutrients and support diverse ecosystems. The increased interaction between land and water can create a variety of habitats, from estuaries and wetlands to mangroves and coral reefs, each supporting different forms of life. The configuration of a planet's landmasses can significantly influence its habitability. On Earth, the division of land into continents and islands has led to the development of distinct biomes and ecosystems, each with its unique flora and fauna. A superhabitable planet might feature even more fragmented landmasses, increasing the potential for ecological niches and promoting biodiversity. Fragmented landmasses could lead to a greater diversity of climates. 
and environments, providing a wider range of conditions under which life could evolve and adapt. For instance, varying elevations can create distinct climatic zones, from lowland forests to mountainous regions. This variety encourages the evolution of species that are specialized for different environments, contributing to the overall richness of life on the planet. The atmosphere of a superhabitable planet would also play a crucial role in supporting life. An ideal atmosphere would be thick enough to provide adequate pressure for liquid water, while also containing gases necessary for life, such as oxygen and carbon dioxide. The presence of these gases could be an indicator of biological activity, as they are often produced and maintained through natural processes involving living organisms. Additionally, a thicker atmosphere could help regulate the planet's temperature, preventing extreme fluctuations between day and night or between seasons. This stability is crucial for maintaining a climate that can support a wide range of life forms over long periods. A stable atmosphere also protects the surface from harmful solar radiation and cosmic rays, which can damage biological tissues and hinder the development of life. The search for superhabitable planets challenges the traditional view that Earth-like planets are the best candidates for life. It suggests that there may be other planetary configurations and environmental conditions that are even more conducive to life. For instance, planets orbiting stars cooler than our sun, such as orange dwarfs, might offer stable environments for longer periods, giving life more time to develop and evolve. Orange dwarf stars have longer lifespans than our sun, often exceeding 20 billion years. This extended stability could allow complex ecosystems to emerge and persist. Without the threat of the star aging and increasing in luminosity, as is expected to happen with our sun, planets orbiting these stars in the habitable zone could experience milder and more consistent climates, further contributing to their potential habitability. The concept of superhabitable planets has profound implications for the search for extraterrestrial life. It suggests that we should not be solely focused on finding Earth twins but rather consider a broader range of planetary environments that could support life. This approach encourages the inclusion of planets that might not initially seem ideal, but possess qualities that could make them even more hospitable than Earth. In summary, the search for superhabitable planets represents an exciting new frontier in astrobiology. By considering planets that are warmer, wetter, and possess more fragmented landmasses than Earth, scientists are broadening our understanding of the conditions that can support life. This shift in perspective not only enhances our quest to find life elsewhere in the universe, but also deepens our understanding of the potential diversity of planetary environments. As we continue to explore the cosmos, the concept of superhabitable planets reminds us that life may flourish in ways and places we have yet to imagine. As our technology advances, missions like the James Webb Space Telescope and the European Space Agency's PLATO mission aim to study these distant worlds in greater detail, searching for signs of life and analyzing their atmospheres. While we haven't yet confirmed the existence of a superhabitable planet, the idea alone inspires a broader view of what might be possible in our universe. Could humanity one day call one of these planets home? The journey to find out continues. Make sure to subscribe, like, and comment below to stay updated on our ongoing exploration of the cosmos. Who knows, our future home might be out there, waiting to be discovered. Until next time, keep looking up.